welcome back to consecutive day 674 of a diary of a rumpreneur please remember this vlog is part of the rumpreneur challenge which is my fundraising mission to save the lives of children by attempting the ultimate ultra marathon find out more about the challenge how you can support it check the links in the comments below but do subscribe to the channel as any ad revenue you generate will be donated to the charities in full and if you'd be so kind to give it a share the more people we get in front of the more money we raise thanks for your support and let's get started So, consecutive day 674 of a diary of a rumpreneur and running, you know what, it's been tough of late. Yesterday, on yesterday's run, um, I actually had to stop at the uh, local news agents when passing to get a drink and uh, a protein bar because I felt pretty faint and um, I don't know, but maybe, you know, I talked a lot about having COVID and running through it. And uh, you know, I only felt at worst about 80, 85%. So I was able to run, all these things. But maybe there's a lingering after effect. Obviously I know a lot about long COVID with my eldest son still on the road to recovery. But um, yeah, there's been the odd occasion where over the 624 days where I've had to stop and refuel. Um, but yeah, it's not been for a long time. so. I think, to be honest with you, it could have been a culmination of things. It could have been the fact that I haven't been eating very well and haven't been getting enough sleep. But um, yeah, you do get that lingering afterthought that perhaps there is something still there following COVID, but I'm still going. So it's day 634 today and I'm staying with friends in, uh, in Norwich. So I'm doing this uh, heather, heather, heather set loop that I've done several times before. and. You know what, it's been a bit, of a bit of a struggle again. I'm feeling a little bit weak, but we'll keep going. So um, on the business front, um, it's like, uh, been a bit slow today because I'm, I'm off. Um, got some contracts out, we've got a few kind of warm leads that we're trying to chase down at the moment. Um, so things are, things are on track, but I think the problem with the, the brokering model that we're now doing where we're trading investment deals, it's, um, it's a numbers game and you're always, you're only as good as your last sale and you're always concerned that maybe last month was a fluke, can you replicate it again and again? And uh, I think that's the ultimate pressure. That's why I've always liked recurring and passive income as opposed to trading income. But um, we are on track, so sometimes it takes a conversation like this with myself to remind myself that you know what, we are still on track. So um, onto the personal front, and um, it's just nice to get away. You know what, this is the first, the first break we've had as a, um, as a family since my oldest has struggled with long COVID. So we've come away to stay with friends. It's only a quiet couple of days, but you know what, it feels like a massive milestone in my oldest son Leo's road to recovery. So um, gonna thoroughly enjoy these next couple of days. It's going to be pretty low okay, case here, we're not going to do a lot. But you know what, I'll have a break, I'll be fresh and recharge, and uh, hopefully it'll do the world of good for my eldest son. So that's pretty much it for me today. Uh, as always, please remember that this vlog is part of the Rumpreneur Challenge, which is my fundraising mission to save the lives of children by attempting the ultimate ultra marathon. Uh, find out more about the challenge, how you can support it, share the links in the comments below. Do subscribe to the channel, any ad revenue we generate will be donated to the charity if you support, and if you'd be so kind to give this a share, the more people we get in front of, the more money we raise. Thanks for your support as always. Stay positive, stay happy, and I'll see you again tomorrow.